Welcome to our podcast, where we explore fascinating stories and ideas from various fields. In this episode, about we will talk about spade-toothed whales and share their findings. Scientists in New Zealand are carrying out a dissection of a spade-toothed whale, which is one of the rarest whale species in the world, as part of the first such examination of the entire specimen. Spade-toothed whales are a kind of beaked whale which have been given the name because of the resemblance of their teeth with spade-like flensing blades. This was used at one time for stripping whales of their blubber. Since the 1800s, seven such whales have been documented and one of them has been found in New Zealand. The five-meter-long male whale had washed ashore in Otago, South Island, in July. The discovery of the whale had created excitement in cetacean specialists who had little knowledge of such rare creatures on the basis of the tissue and bones of earlier such specimens, which were found decades before. On December 2nd, international and local scientists gathered along with local Maori and started the examination of the whale at the Invermay Agri-Search Centre in Mosgiel. The atmosphere in the centre has been of reverence for the animal, explained Anton van Helden, who is a global expert on the spade-toothed whale and a science advisor at the Department of Conservation. We're working around a dead animal, but it's telling us about how it lived, and also that's unpacking all of the life stories of the people involved around it, Helden said. The paper's lead author, Van Helden, said that the appearance of the species has given an opportunity to examine the whale, which is an incredible moment. Beaked whales are the most enigmatic group of large mammals on the planet. They are deep divers that are rarely seen at sea. This one is the rarest of the rare only the seventh specimen known from anywhere in the world, and the first opportunity we have had to undertake a dissection like this, Heldon said. In 1874, scientists had found the first such spade-toothed whale when the species got its name on the basis of its description, which was two teeth and lower jawbone in the Chatham Islands, which is off the east coast of New Zealand's South Island. Scientists have been working alongside the local Maori from Otaku. The local Maori possess the customary rights of the area where the whale appeared. The study's contributing writer, Tumai Cassidy, said that Maori consider whales a taonga, which is a sacred treasure of cultural significance. Whales are incredibly important animals in our culture. Our arrival to Aotearoa, New Zealand, is deeply tied to whales, and like other cultures around the world, we utilize different parts of their bodies, he said. Thanks for tuning in to this incredible story. If this episode resonated with you, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button for more captivating stories to come. Stay tuned.